Ross Strong on Magic. I'm Kimberly Walsh, and speaking of strong, I've got Denise Van Outen on the phone from China. Hello, darling. You had to call me a strong moment, because since we last spoke, I've just been up about another 200 steps. Oh, don't. It sounds like hell. (laughs) It's it's, what, you know what, it's the opposite to that, because I'm just to be approached, just to fill you in on where I am exactly. I'm in Mutan U, and I'm just about to approach what is called the Heavenly Staircase, by the time I've reached the top of the heavenly staircase, which is most people, if they know uh, China, will, will know of this. It's, it's a very big tourist spot where lots of people come to. But most people, to reach the top of the heavenly staircase, take a cable car. We've, we're tracking it. We're walking it. <laughs> and by the time I reach the top, Kimberly, I'll have walked up to over 3,000 steps. Oh, imagine how much moaning I would have been doing to get up 3,000 <laughs> steps. <laughs> Oh, so what are you missing? What are you missing about home? I miss so many things. I mean, people think that you come and do something like this. It's not, you know, although it's really well organised, it is a charity trip and it is a challenge. And the, the places that we go back to after we've been trekking, after walking for hours and hours each day, sometimes up to eight hours a day, they're not glamorous, luxurious hotels. I mean, we stayed in, like, the other night in a hotel. Well, even as I say, it's a hotel, it's not, it was more of a hostel and there was yeah. no hot water, no electricity. You know, there wasn't even, a, there wasn't a shower. No. I basically had a hole in the floor and this like hose pipe where I literally had to just try and try and wash myself so it, it's not it's not bad yeah I can so actually I mean, totally imagine that kind of you know hostel I've stayed at a few you know in Africa I mean, you know you have and it you do feel a million miles away from home and obviously you've not got Betsy to give you cuddles every night when you get in I and know. it's just you know it's hard you're taking yourself completely out of your comfort zone but you know it's for an I amazing know. cause it is. And I miss, I miss having a bath, a really hot bath. I miss, do you know what, when I get back, I really want to have a nice roast dinner. Even if it's not on a Sunday, I'm just going to have a nice roast dinner. Is that the one thing you're craving? <laughs> and do you know what? English mustard. Because <laughs> I love English mustard. <laughs> <laughs> it's like certain things you just, you just miss out of nowhere. You don't realise what you kind of, you know, what you appreciate most until you don't have it anymore, do you? Yeah. Do you know what? I have to tell you something quite sweet that Betsy did say is the, um, though, because I have managed to speak to her oh, on good. the phone. Just got, I got through to her just once when we managed to get a signal, and um, I spoke to her, and she said to me, I, where are you, Mummy? And I said, Mummy's in China, darling. And she went, well, Mummy, be careful you don't smash it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I think she thinks you're having a nice afternoon tea with some lovely china mugs or something. She didn't have a clue what her mum's actually putting herself through. And do you know what? I really wish I was having an afternoon tea right now. Well, we'll have one when you get back. Definitely. I can't wait to see you. And you're doing such a fantastic job. And I want to ask, I've got one request. Yeah. Hit me with it. Right, because you know how much I love your album and you know how much little Betsy loved it. Oh. You can see in the car all the time. Would you please just play me your duet with Ronan Keating, Falling Slowly, because it would really spur me on to get up the stairway to heaven. Oh, I'd love to do that. I'd love to do that. Hopefully Betsy will be listening in too. She is. And you'll be back in the hot seat next week at Magic HQ, so I'll just keep it a little bit warm for you and uh, we all miss you here. So be safe and I'll see you when you get back. Thank you, darling. Lots of love. See you soon. Bye. Bye.